Hey guys, what's up? Back at you with another video. I just want to do a little vlog for you guys today because something absolutely horrifying happened to me and I want to share it with you and I hope you guys enjoy it because I did not enjoy it at all. To start off, I work as a maintenance technician for the building I live in and some of the other staff and all that were like I thought they were rumors. They were telling me about this old lady that lives in the building and I guess she had well not a guess because I know now but she has like a bunch of cats and all this stuff and she calls this apartment she calls her own apartment the pussy palace and she's like 70 years old and she apparently hits on any guy that goes in there and I didn't know what to think of it. I thought they were just fucking with me. I didn't know whether to believe it or not. And then, yeah, this is what, yeah. Let's just say they weren't fucking with me. They were not fucking with me. And it was awful. It was just freaking awful. All right, so this is what happened. <laughs> I got sent in there to change out all of her old plastic doorknobs to these new pewter ones, you know, just they're nicer and they don't break as easy. And so I went in there and I started pulling the doorknobs out and everything. She disappeared, went into a room or something. And then I think thought to myself, perfect. I don't have to deal with her just in case what they said was true. But then, just after I finished thinking that, she comes out of the bedroom wearing nothing but a nightie. She comes up to me and she whispers in my ear, You do that fast. What else do you do fast? And proceeds to try and put her hands around my waist. Ooh, no, 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 that is not okay. I friggin, I thought to myself, I'm like, I'm like, oh my god, am I gonna get raped? Is this lady gonna friggin, like, try and roofie me and fucking take advantage of me? This is nuts. She's 70 years old, and she's full force coming on to me, and I was not having any of it. That was not okay. I managed to wiggle my way out of it, and I friggin dropped everything I was doing, and I pretty much ran right out of that apartment. And as I'm shutting the door, she winks at me and tells me I'm welcome in the Pussy Palace anytime. No, 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 no Pussy Palace, no Pussy Palace, absolutely not. I have to tell you, that was the most disturbing event that I've had to go through. It was horrifying and I will never ever go back to the Pussy Palace because next time I might not come back. No. Well, anyways, thanks for listening. I just wanted to share that with you because you guys might find it entertaining. Meanwhile, I'm scarred for life. Thank you, Pussy Palace lady, you friggin' freak of a 70-year-old woman. Alright, thanks for listening, guys. I will talk to you later.